What's up, Cougars? I'm Hallie, and today is Friday, November 20th. And I'm Zoe, and it's a white day. Please, Please rise, rise and, and join, join us for the pledge. I, I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. For today's lunch, we have roast turkey, stuffing, and a hot roll. And the premium meal is cheese or pepperoni pizza. And for the sides, we have mashed potatoes and gravy, green beans, cranberry sauce, strawberry cup, and pumpkin pie. For Tuesday's lunch, we have beef fiestata pizza or cheese rippers. And the premium meal is tenders bar. And for the sides, we have peas, crinkle fries, fresh orange wedges, and a rice krispie treat. Hey, do you have a joke for today? Um, I actually don't. Oh, it's okay. I have one. Why did the turkey cross the road? Um, why? Because it was Thanksgiving, and he wanted people to think he was a chicken. Oh, I get it. Hey, we are well into November now, so... Let me guess. I should know the character word. Man, you are on it today. So what is it? Um, I don't actually remember. I just remembered we were at that point in the show. Man, I was so excited that you actually remembered, but I guess not. It is citizenship, and it means being loyal to your school, community, and country. What a great character word, especially with Veterans Day last week. True, and a great reminder to make sure we are including everyone who is part of our CMS community. Do you know what the best way is to keep up with your assignments and classes? By checking our emails in Schoology daily, especially the update tab in Schoology. Although Wednesdays will be the day when teachers are sending out the new lessons slash activities for the week, checking daily is a fantabulous way to ensure that you are staying up to date with your classes. Don't forget, there are still copies of the 2019-2020 yearbook available for purchase. That's right, Cougars. We have several copies of this amazing book still available in case you did not get yours last year. If you would like to get your hands on one of these historical yearbooks, you can come see Mrs. Fetch, room 502, before or during your tutorial. You should only come down if you have the money with you. They are $35 and will be available until we sell out again. That is room 502 during tutorial time and only if you have the money with you. Get your copy of the 2019-2020 yearbook now. And now for our awesome influential person segment. Our influential person this week is Franklin Chang Diaz. Franklin Chang Diaz was the first Hispanic American astronaut. The Costa Rican born physicist completed seven space missions for NASA. Chang Diaz was born on April 5, 1950 in San Jose, Costa Rica. His father was of Chinese heritage and his mother was Costa Rican. Chang Diaz hoped to become an astronaut and a U.S. citizen, and he grew up to achieve both dreams. Chang Diaz completed high school in Costa Rica and left his family at the age of 18 to study in the United States. He enrolled as a senior at, in Hartford Public High School in Connecticut to learn English. After graduating in 1969, he went on to study mechanical engineering at the University of Connecticut and graduated in 1973. Shang Diaz completed a doctorate in applied plasma physics at the Massachusetts Institution of Technology in 1977. 
NASA selected Chang Diaz, one of just 19 other candidates pulled from a pool of 3,000 people to join the space program in 1980. He participated in his first space mission on the Columbia in 1996. Chang Diaz traveled into space on six other space flights, including on the shuttle Endeavour. He spacewalked into the International Space Station to deliver research equipment to the platform and repair the station's robotic arm in 2002. After logging more than 1,600 hours in space, he retired as an 